It's been a long time since I've done a whole box break for you, and uh, as you guys have, uh, as you might know, as I've talked about a little bit, I really want to collect all of Tops this year, season, Series 1, 2, Update, uh, and I, I don't want to just buy a factory set. How boring is that? So I wanted to buy a, uh, let's get it kicked off the right way with a jumbo hobby box. Um, <clears throat> the idea for me was I was going to wait a while, as you know, these came out a long time ago, and I would wait for the price to come down a little bit and then, then go for it. Uh, however, when you wait a long time, it's hard to find these silver packs, uh, which apparently are much more limited. Uh, fortunately, I was able to find a box that came with the very hard to find silver packs, but on the one condition that I bought two boxes, which also came with silver packs. So I don't know if I'm going to open this box, uh, definitely not today. If you have any interest, if you are out there looking to buy one of these, uh, just let me know. Shoot me a line. Uh, we can maybe work something out uh, without eBay and all that. Uh, save us both a little cash. But let me know if you're interested in buying a jumbo box with the silver packs. Uh, today, I'm going to just go through this one. And um, much like I did with Optic a uh, few videos back, since this product's been around a long time, you probably don't have as much interest in sitting around and watching me open every single pack. But I'm going to take a look at everything, uh, look for the short prints, look for all the parallels, uh, see what I've found, and then we'll, we will open up these together at the very end. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm just going to sit back, watch my White Sox, who uh, Lucas Giolito is currently owning the Twins. Okay, still going good as I say that. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll see you after I have opened this, and hopefully we get something really, really awesome. First off, just look at the size of the packs. Gotta love that. Love that. So I'm going to take my time, have some fun, and I'll see you through the magic of Fast Forward. Alright, looking around, here is the base cards we got. Obviously, there's going to be quite a lot of those. And uh, well, let's go on tour of what a, uh, a hobby jumbo box looks like. We'll start with maybe perhaps one of the least interesting subsets. We got a whole bunch of uh, stadium cards. Of course, no White Sox. <laughs> uh, Philly, St. Louis, LA, Philly again, Boston, Washington, uh, Anaheim, Oakland, Houston, the Yankees, uh, Toronto, Boston, Seattle, Atlanta, Chicago, Cubs, uh, Pittsburgh, and Milwaukee's beautiful Miller Park. Um, I do have to say that there were not very many doubles in here, which is always something I appreciate. The next set we got a lot of would be future stars, and I think in this world of liking to get rookie cards and, and things of that sort, get the young guys, that's always a good thing. Ronald Guzman, Lord Scurriel Jr. Of course, those two again, just as I talk about not having too many doubles. Uh, Joey Lucchese, Derek Rodriguez, Jack Flannery, Fran Mel Reyes, Willie Calhoun, Lucchese again, Shane Bieber, Brian Anderson, and Jordan Hicks, future stars. Uh, of course, as I always say, if you see doubles of anything and it's something that you want, just let me know and we'll make it happen. This isn't really an insert set at all, it's part of the base, but very neat, all of these dual cards. I wish they said the names, uh, even if it was just on the back, but uh, they don't. But here's uh, Betts and Benetene, Sonny Gray and Didi. Gregorius, Bregman and Otani, got Rizzo and oh, Selvi Perez. That's an unusual pairing. Uh, Bregman, I, no, Correa and Altuve. Baez and Arnado. Judge and Didi. Pujols and Betts. And finally, Harper, still in a Washington uniform. With, I'm going to guess that's Scooter Jeanette. You can let me know if I'm wrong on that one. 84 Design. Colby Allard. Adrian Beltre. Noah Syndergaard. Paul Goldschmidt. Still Diamondbacks on there. JT Realmuto. Willie McCovey. That's awesome. David Ortiz. And Glaber Torres. Um, <clears throat> Again, these are cards that are just part of the base. They're not an insert, but uh, league leaders. Blake Snell. Chris Davis. Jacob DeGrom, Nolan Arnado, Christian Yelich, 
Mookie Betts, Javi Baez, Max Scherzer, and Chris Davis. Of course, this series is all about the anniversary, 150 years of organized baseball. So we're celebrating greatest seasons. Got one for Elber Pujols and one for Mike Piazza. Oh, so those are greatest seasons and greatest moments. We have Carlton Fisk, of course, that iconic down the right field foul line home run. Jackie Robinson, Babe Ruth, and Ted Williams. We did pretty well with the rookie cups as well. Got Juan Soto, Miguel Andahar, and Glaber Torres. Harrison Bader, Ronald Acuna Jr., Shohei Otani, and then another, Torres and Andahar. Two tops now cards from Aaron Judge and Ronald Acuna Jr. If you're going to get two, those are pretty good ones. They have these postseason and World Series highlights cards. We've got two Steve Pierce cards, a David Price, and J.D. Martinez. There's one sig singular evolution of the game, looking at Crosley Field for the Cincinnati Reds. And we have two iconic card reprints, Wade Boggs and Roberto Clemente. My favorite insert set, which I think these might only come one per box, uh, Got a pretty good one. Glaber Torres and Derek Jeter here, The Greatness Returns. Uh, I would love to get all these. Actually, of course, I'm trying to get all of the inserts. As far as parallel cards, we have one in a black. Very difficult to see, so you definitely want to check these out closely. Robbie Ray, number two, 150. It is 114 of 150. And two of the gold cards, which are numbered to 2019, Kyle Seeger and Ian Kennedy. Not numbered, the rainbow foiled parallels. We have Lorenzo Cain, which of course I'm happy about since I live in Wisconsin right now. Mike Zanino, Randall Gertchik. We have a future star, Rainbow, Shane Bieber, and Chris Taylor. Oh, and back to the 150 year theme. Here are the cards that have that nice 150 year stamp in the corner. Uh, I'm just going to say Jed, because I actually have never heard that guy's name pronounced. Uh, Ramon Laureano, rookie. Jacob DeGrom, league leader. J.D. Martinez, World Series card. Harrison Bader with the Rookie Cup. And that brings us back around. So it's easy to feel where the Relic cards were, and I haven't seen them yet. So, in addition to what you've already been shown, uh, we've got a Matt Carpenter here, throwback card on top. Let's widen out a little bit. And our first relic is, what do we have here? Oh, an Oriole. <laughs> Never the best start, but you know, we'll see what happens. And it is Trey Mancini, numbered to just 25. This is major league material, game used material. Uh, Trey Mancini's had a great year so far. So if you're gonna get an Oriole uh, on the active roster, that might be the one to get. There it is, numbered to 25 and game used. And our second relic, let's see what we got. We do have a throwback, Dennis Eckersley. Let's get these couple from behind. Calendario and uh, oh, Sweet Life with Max and Cody. That's a funny one. Max Muncy and home run hidden Cody Bellinger. And let's see, it looks like a similar style of card. Um, Boy, oh, it's a commemorative patch logo, so it is a manufactured one. It is Carlos Correa. So, not a huge fan of the manufactured relics, but Carlos Correa is awesome. And that is number two, 150. 86 of 150. Our autograph, I stumbled across in the middle of everything because it didn't stand out at all. Uh, just kind of blended in. And it is a Patrick Wisdom autograph. Uh, he rookie card. It's I like getting a an autograph on a non base card, so that is cool. Uh, Patrick Wisdom came up. He was a first round pick with the Cardinals and was traded. I think just this year. I can't remember if it was mid season or in the off season to the Texas Rangers. So he is in that system currently. But there you have it. That oh oh my gosh! How did I almost forget that we have these to do? So of course, getting an autograph on, or a parallel even on here, one of these is a, uh, would be a huge get. So, 
Keeping with the Astros fun, we have George Springer, Adalberto Mondesi, Glaber Torres, that's very cool to get, and throwback art, Will Clark. Last pack, big time mojo and love and luck. Let's get all the good stuff going, see so what we can get. Yadi Molina, these are nice thick cards. Chance Adams, rookie card. Charlie Blackman. And finally, from the Cubs, oh, Mark Grace. I always gotta love Mark Grace. Even growing up a White Sox fan, surrounded by Cubs fans, he is uh, just a really solid hitter in the 300s or so all the time. And of course, these are really nice looking cards. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. I'm gonna be back with another video very, very soon that I'm gonna film today, but uh, probably put out in the next day or two.